Hello and welcome to another video. In this video, Overwatch 2 Invasion, the official trailer for the entire season has just dropped. I have not watched it yet and I'm super hyped. Let's get into it. We'll watch it first and then we'll go back through and break down whatever we can find. Carry my burdens alone. Captive Sun is ready to burn. Face the sunrise! Push forward. I'm taking the objective. Come on over. Justice reigns from above. Advancements discovered. Do anything it takes. We have a lot of work to do out there. There it is. That that was awesome. Um Sorry if I blew out your ears. Anyway, uh, let's go back through and let's quickly see what we can see. Looks like we got uh, right off the bat, we got a casual skin for Brig, which is looking pretty cool. Uh, if we go forward a bit, actually, we'll just do what we do. Uh, nope, <laughs> we want to keep it on quality, even though YouTube's compression is messing it up anyway. All right, so we got some scenes from the PVE mode. So this is our first real look at the new character. Although from the video, I couldn't really discern what her abilities do, um, except for like one of them. But it looks like she is the Sojourn equivalent for your support. So if you play Sojourn, play this character. That's what it looks like anyway. Um, just like if you play Junkrat, play Baptiste. It's like... They have like the same way of aiming, firing, and that sort of stuff, but <clears throat> still, let's uh, let's keep going. New a invasion event, so it's showing us some scenes from, I believe this is going to be Toronto. Yep, that's definitely Toronto. Um, obviously, Ramatra is commanding some of this. We have one of the big artillery tanks. We have the boss at the end of... This is the boss at the end of Paracio. So, there we have that. Is there anything in there that we should be aware of? I can't really see much. So Someone will slow it down. I think it's just Ramadra. In our darkest hour... We have some of the visuals from Paracio, which is pretty cool. 
So it looks like it's teasing who the heroes in each one will be. So for this is, oh, it's hard to see there. I think you can use multiple characters. Because it shows Reinhardt, it shows, what did it show? It showed Reinhardt, Brigida, Lucio, but then here it's going to show Winston. Got the big ship in the background. See, there's Winston. So I don't know. Maybe maybe you can choose your character. Or there's probably a mode where you can choose your character. Got hammered down. We got some more stuff in Toronto, which is actually parts of Toronto that we haven't seen before. So that will be very cool. Super excited for that. Um, here's our new support hero, a closer look. So her name is Ilari. And this isn't a sword, it's a gun. And she has, yeah, some form of energy railgun. So it looks like, yeah, some sort of like pulse rifle or something like that. She has a jump where she heals herself. I don't know what that does, but that looks like it does a massive explosive, just a lot of damage. That's what it looks like. I can't tell if that's healing her teammate or not in the bottom there. I, it's hard to see because everything's yellow. Got the new flashpoint. And here are some uh, skins. So we have an... On a, I think this is the this is going to be the um, mythic skin for this season is going to be Anna because you see her and like this is a different from what we see in the rest of the trailer. Uh, we got Ash here looking pretty cool. There's a really cool uh, Omnic Fara. We got Omnic Lacree, and then we got like an overgrown hog. Or sorry, god damn it. I meant uh, Omnic Cassidy, obviously. Overgrown Hog. Then we have, again, Casual. It looks so weird when they're running. But we got Casual Brig. We have Vampire Torb. I don't know what this is. He looks really old. The new character, obviously. We have sort of a... Outland Zarya, which this actually looks like a nice skin. So Zarya finally getting good skins? Question mark. And then we have an Outlands Junkrat, which that just is probably going to be an epic skin, but I'll take it. Here's another ability for the new character. So you can throw this against a wall and it will heal enemies around it, sort of like Symmetra. I don't know if it's destroyable or not. I mean, it probably will be, but... Explore PvP maps. So, obviously, these are the two maps. We got Suravasa, which looks very beautiful, and New Jug City, which looks really cool. We have the new game mode. So, Hero Mastery. Pretty much just PvE time trial stuff. Are you ready for more? There's going to be more. We have the all-new Invasion Battle Pass. I don't know what that was. Who is that? Is that Genji? Is that who that is? No, that's Echo. That's Echo. They, like, floated away. That's Echo. Um. Okay, so we got... We, got, we have... That's Echo... Then we have Torb, Zarya, Ash. Those are cool snake eyes. That's a, I guess, an epic skin for Winston. Got Winston's doctor skin, and he's got a banana. Uh, the overgrown hog skin. 
Got the Omnic Fara skin. That one looks so cool. That one looks sick. And then uh, what I believe is the Mythic Ana skin, which actually looks insane. Like, this looks so good. This is this definitely, if this is the Mythic skin, this definitely tops um, Genji's Mythic skin. This is so cool. If not, then it's just a really cool skin. Uh, we got the Underworld co-op uh, PvP uh, or PvE event where Tim has just guns now, because of course he does. Uh, Ilari launch event, so maybe there's going to be a short amount of time where you can play the character even if you don't buy them from the Battle Pass, just as like a trial thing. Or it's just going to give you a spray. <laughs> that works too, I guess. Hero Mastery event, so there, I guess there's Hero Mastery and then there's events for it as well. We'll see how that goes, I guess. Overwatch 2 Anniversary event for 2023 is going to be coming in. Uh, anniversary always has like the coolest skins, and we should be getting dance emotes for all the new characters that have come out um, in the past year that don't have dance. So Junker Queen... Sojourn, uh, Kiriko, uh, we're getting to too many heroes, I can't even remember, Ramatra, is that it? Is it just four? I feel like I'm missing someone. Oh well. Anyway, getting more dance emotes. <laughs> All right. So, see cuz here they have Reinhardt, Tracer, Genji, and Lucio. But then we saw Winston on this map. So, I'm going to guess that you can choose through I guess any of the Overwatch characters. This person here that they keep Flashing up. See, I thought this was Ramatra at first, but that's not Ramatra's silhouette. Unless they're unless they're sticking John Cena back in here just cause. Yeah, no, that's not. Maybe they're just teasing at another bad guy, but you can only see a silhouette, so it's it, it doesn't look like anyone we know of. And then we got what I'm going to guess is our mythic skin for Ana, which looks sick. I was I was expecting a tank cuz following the pattern, that's what it was looked like it was going to be like, but this Ana skin is so cool. I cannot wait to uh, grind for this one. Um, this definitely takes top spot as the best mythic skin, if if that's what it is. I'm gonna guess what that is because that's that's way too dope of a skin. Anyway, um, that's it for now. Oh. Invasion goes live. Uh, I believe. Uh, the tenth at. I believe the tenth at three o'clock e Eastern Standard Time, either two or three o'clock Eastern Standard Time, and uh, yeah, we'll definitely be streaming it because it is very cool. Anyway, I'll see you in the next one. Bye.